I feel so disgustingly nervous about a lot of things. Just making this video is making me think a bunch of things, which is sad. I started caring too much again, uh, in a bad way. Like, caring isn't necessarily a bad thing. Caring is obviously very good most of the time. But when you start caring about irrelevant things, like superficial things, it just... There gets a point to the point when it's just... you, you just should stop. Like, for example, last night I, I had one of those moments, too, when I was feeling like we have relatives coming in now. Um, we're meeting them tonight, and then uh, Friday is the big night we're all going to hang out. And it's going to be kind of a medium gathering, or maybe even small, depending on what, what you're used to. We're going to be, like, 23 people, I think. So, uh, could be worse. And that's me included, I really hope, and I do know, like, mother and my aunt, so, I mean, uh, it'll be okay, but they're mostly adults, and I don't know, even if they're my age, like, we don't have a lot in common, because I'm just a total nerd. I, like, vlog on the internet, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna be like, haha, I like fandom, and I'm a nerd, and I put videos on the internet, and they're gonna be, like, normal mortals, and... <laughs> So I had this moment of thinking, like, I wanted to cut my hair, and uh, I haven't, and then I realized, I, I got so, you know, stressed about my appearance, it was like, Mac, what are you doing? This is, this is not who you are, this is not what you do, you don't really care about these things, so stop, calm down. And the same thing is happening with my vlogging, I, as you can tell, I'm not really vlogging a, a lot right now, and... Um, because my dog, you know, got sick, and she's much better now, of course. Uh, that, 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 of course, makes sense that I wasn't, you know, putting up videos all the time then, because that's a real serious, um, life distraction. But apart from that, it's like, I don't do much, so what was I doing? Just sitting there doing nothing, and I, I started caring too much about, about editing my videos, and... I wanted them to be, to, you know, a little bit entertaining and not too long and to always be edited and what music to put there and, oh no, that glitch happened there, I have to edit it again and I have to do this and, ah, uh, and then I never, ever, ever, like I have clips right now that I'm looking on my laptop here that I have so many clips and I just feel this daunting sensation of like, no, 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 so I never get around to it, which means that I never vlog. And when did that happen? When did I start caring? Because that's not what I do. I don't video blog in sketch form or in, in a transcript, scripted way. I, d I don't, I'm, I'm not doing it for entertainment. I do it for me. It's not like if you have a personal diary right here, right now, it's not like, like you write in it to entertain people. You write in it to just vent your emotions or whatever you want to do, and you put it down. And that's what I'm doing, because this is my blog, and it's in video form. It's a vlog. That's what it is. And I, I, I have a little square video grainy footage with me talking for like six minutes sometimes. This is me, and this is my personality, and this is what I put out there. And this is what I like putting out there. I'm, I'm not one of those... Do the whole editing thing all the time. And now I got so stuck caring about that again in a negative way. Like, I was just like, no, I can't put this out. It's too long. It's too boring. I mean, those feelings are natural. They happen sometimes. They happen to me occasionally. Of course, I mean, e even when I say that I don't care, it's like I do care sometimes. I can feel like, like this video, for example. But what is this? Who wants to sit and listen to this repetitive stuff for like over four minutes but this is the way I vlog I need to be like oh come on this is what I mean you can do both parts but when you get too stuck with one it's like ah oh, goodness I want to vlog and I want to talk to you but I don't anymore because I'm like I have to edit this and this and this and I have to upload this before this and do this and blah, blah, blah. and now the relatives are coming here they're originally, well, I guess they're originally from Sweden, but they've been living in New Zealand 
And then when the family moved to Barcelona, actually. So they're coming from there, and, and they're two brothers. So one family moved to Barcelona, and the other brother is still in New Zealand, and they're all coming here. And we're going to meet, and we have family from around here, of course, Sweden. And, and so we're going to be, like, about 25 people. And, and, we're, and now I feel like family to me has never been too important. I mean, uh, close family. I love my close family, but... Like, I, 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 the only thing I grew up with, like, my grandpa died when I was very little, and then I, and he was also kind of grumpy, so I don't remember much of him, and, and I, I, the only, like, relatives I've been close to, I mean, they're my aunt and my cousin, and, and I know them, I like them, I care about them, but, and I met another aunt, like, a couple of times, but I'd maybe be able to point her out on a picture, but I have no emotional connection to them, and, and, to me, my friends have always been the most important things in my life. And I love this whole thing about making making your own family with, you know, just with friends and other people. Like, blood isn't the most important thing to me, it, just for the sake of we are related. So, and then I feel bad about that, of course, because I feel like I should care because, wow, blood, we're family, you know. Even though we're complete strangers, we're supposed to, you know, be connected somehow and but they're coming here and I feel like all of them are like normal adults like I'm an adult too you know what I mean but they're like 60 so there are only so much I can be like oh hello hello and small talk and what am I gonna do then just sit there and I'm not too bothered with all of this so it feels I don't I don't uh, I mean it's gonna be interesting in a way I, I want to say like hi but but at the same time, the negative is just like boom, over the positive. I just feel like I, I don't want to. I don't want to. Oh, I can't be bothered to do. I have to, and I have to go meet them today, tonight. And I have all of these emotions that I've bottled up inside without letting out. So that's why I feel a little bit almost nauseous right now. It's like oh, I have to do so much, and I have to go into town now, and. And everything is just so much, and it's just so much, and I feel so weird about so many things, and bad, and good, and I'm so confused, and I just miss talking to you, and talking to no, and talking to myself, making videos just venting for myself, because I need to just open the floodgates and just word vomit, vomit my personal stuff all over the internet, and then have people watch that and connect a little bit, and the whole thing's really weird, but I kind of love it, so it's what I do. I feel like I didn't get any point across that I wanted to get across. I mostly rambled, but that's what's been happening, and it's not always going to be like this, and it's not always going to be like that either. Things are going to mix, and things are going to change, and everything is just fluid, and things, you know, change all the time. So, if you feel like, what is this nine-minute video for McDonald? Like, I don't care. I want the edited stuff. Then the edited stuff will come, and, you know, it even says so on my channel that it can be light, it can be dark, long videos, short videos, you know, whatever. Floats my boat, you know, whatever happens. Goodness gracious me, I thank you for watching, if you're watching, and Jesus Christ, I'm going mental today, I just, I just want to run away, I just want to run away, I feel like I'm just jittery panic here, ugh, but I'm gonna have to drink some water and calm down and deal with the situation. And realize that it's okay to feel the way I'm feeling, whether it's positive or negative, and it's gonna be okay. And you should remember that too, that no matter what you're feeling, it's it's okay. Like, you're supposed to feel things, even if it's bad things or good things. Or if you're confused, then be confused for a while, because you're gonna calm down and figure it out eventually. That's what happens. So, sometimes it takes a while, but it's all good. So, just take a moment, take a breath, and just, okay, that's, that's what we learned today. <laughs> oh my Thank you. Goodbye then.